God bless you all. We are talking about the tangibles, the tangibles. Mama Debbie, if you want to, you know, talk about, if that's what Mommy was talking about, being wise, basing it on righteousness and integrity. Mm. Amen. And yeah, thanks, Mommy. Um, we know that, like Mommy said, God is a God who expects us to be blessed. And his blessings include wealth. Mm. Uh -huh. So, I mean, if you look through the ages, the pages of the Bible, you see Abraham was wealthy, mm. you know, but he knew his priorities, you know, and all the way down. Uh, and then even I, I knew, I read of a story concerning one of these famous people in America, I think Pepsodent or one of them. Mm. And the person was tithing. Tithing is a secret, seriously. Mm. It comes with great blessing because God himself is saying, will a man rob God? I mean, you will rob me, but how will you rob God? Come on. You know, he who the fount, everything of life is in his hands. Mm -hmm. And then you think you can rob him and get away with it. Mm -hmm. You know, and, and, and through this, my little walk with him, I have noticed that one thing is if you are faithful. Yeah. If you are faithful in your dealings with people, mm -hmm. if you are faithful with your dealings, with all around you and then also with him he surely will be faithful to you mm. even the little money that you can put down god can multiply it to such a big money i tell my boys i told them i said look one secret i have known i mean we we don't have much when i see my husband I say yeah we are rich you know <laughs> god has blessed us and all that i say yeah amen to that because my father god is rich so i'm rich that's true but I tell them that there's a secret to blessing, and that is tithing. Mm. When you tithe, God will block the devourer. Yeah. The devourer who will come in to destroy, he will block him from your land. So let us be honest and clear in our dealings, and God will help us to say, sometimes you may be there, and then there may be an idea, oh, there's this investment that has come up. You didn't know somebody will call you before you know it. You'll be making quite a bit of money. I had one of, uh, my son was telling me that one of the friends in the school, just within this lockdown time, uh, this guy uh, got, a, I think, a grant or something. And then he also, with that grant, he was able to get some money to invest. Before you know it, this boy has been able to receive enough money to buy a condo, a small boy in university. Mm. The way God deals with us, is just incredible. And sometimes if it's, it's even health. Your health is protected. Your mm. family's health, like you said, there's no leakage of going to the doctor's office time in and time again, spending money, not having peace of mind. But if we are faithful to God, the mm. legacy he will leave for us, even in the tangibles, are so great. We will not put our hearts in those legacies, knowing for a fact that it is just God who has blessed us in that sense. And so all the glory and the honor belongs to him. Amen. Amen. God bless you so much, mommy.